hit this one, drinks are on me. I ain't going to a bar with you, handsome. You confuse all the broads. <laughs> Louis is this extraordinarily witty, charming, full of fire, imperfect man. So casting Louis was such a very, very difficult task, such an exciting thing. He had to be this person that you felt that the audience would root for. Somebody that does have a very strong spirit. Don't look at me. And somebody who's soulful enough to love and respect Louis to understand the growth of the man. So I met Jack and couldn't stop smiling through the whole meeting because there's something about the way he carried himself. I knew he was Louis. I, I just feel completely honored by the fact that I'd be able to immortalize uh, a life story of someone who's arguably lived three or four lifetimes. The whole thing was mammoth. I was at the bottom of a mountain, but then it becomes a study on the individual. It was very interesting un unraveling uh, what it was about Louis that gave him that level of endurance, the lessons he must have picked up on a racetrack and then how that backed him up in a prisoner of war environment. So I really wanted to know what fueled him. This man must be taught respect. All other prisoners will teach him this lesson. We cannot do that. I settled with the opinion that he's not the most important person in his thinking. Don't do it, sir. Come on. Just get over it. Punch him! All that emphasis on looking after number one and didn't seem to apply to him. It hurt! Come on! Hit me! Next! The enormity of what Louis persevered through and what he was forced through and what he survived and endured. I, I just feel blown away. And that's something I'll take with me for the rest of my life. <laughs>